hi guys welcome back to techie gyan for another exciting video today i'm going to show you how to consolidate or merge multiple data tables into a single pivot this cool feature is really helpful for people who works with loads of excel data every day so guys let's get started here i have three sheets First sheet contains the sales information of cars in the car showroom. The second sheet contains the color information associated with these car models. And the third sheet contains the location or territory category of these sales. So if I need to grab or extract the cost information based on the color, or based on the state of sales I need to consolidate all the three sheets into a single pivot because all the information lies in different sheets so the first step you need to do is convert your data ranges on the three sheets into a table for that select onto any cells in the table in the, in the data go to the insert tab select the option table click ok now go to the design go to the option table name and uh, rename the table to model do the same step to the remaining two sheets select on the cell go to insert click on table click ok rename the cell to table name to color save for the third sheet select go insert table click ok rename to state now all the three sheets the data has been converted into a table now prepare your pivot table for creating the table go to the insert tab select onto the pivot table option here is the trick in order to create in order to extract or consolidate your data into a single pivot you need to select this option add this data into a data table data model select onto this option click ok now you can see your pivot table fields have been appeared here you can see two tabs one is active and one is all if you click all you can see the three separate sheets you have which is the model color and the state all the three sheet has been consolidated into that pivot table now for example I need to see the cost of sales or I mean the sales happened in the area say for example Washington so the cost information lies in the table model which is the cost and the state information is in another table which is the state so click on to the state and cost you can see all the values are coming the same and you can see an error machine is prompting that the relationship between the tables need to be created. So what is the Excel is asking for you is that we have to relate these three separate sheets which is the color, model and the state with their relationship. This can be done in the analyze tab relationship or by directly clicking on to create. The relationship can only be established 
if you have a unique or primary key in both the sheets all the sheets i mean that means if you look at look closely you can see that say for the table the table's color model and state all has a unique column that is the customer id you can see it here if you select model still you can see the customer id here and if you can see the state still you can see the customer id so you can say that the customer id is the unique key or a primary key which we say in access is available in all the sheets so if i want to establish a relationship this is how we do that for example i go to model which includes the cost information and I take the unique column customer ID and I relate that model with the state information I have also with the same customer ID see what happens if I click OK you can see Excel captures you know it started to relate the column both model and state to capture the information of the cost you can see the cost is getting varied here so the same cost was showing before same if you want to relate the color information with the cost you have to again create a relationship go to analyze go to relationship you can create a new one with respect to the cost that is model and color again you relate the unique ID that is a customer ID in both sheets if you click OK and close now if you want to see the color information for example remove the state information now you go to the color and select the color you can see the cost for various colors. Hope you guys enjoy this video and I believe this will be very helpful for you, for people who are working with Excel files and data. If you like my video, please like and subscribe to my video and channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.